Welcome to Whiskey Wednesday. My name is Dean, and this is Eno E Whiskey Whiskey. Welcome, and today I'll be tasting for you Traverse City American Cherry Edition Bourbon. This is made the Traverse City Whiskey Company in Traverse City, Michigan, the cherry capital of the world, which kind of explains the reason why they decided to go ahead and take a bourbon and infuse it with cherry flavor. Uh, steep with what's called Mont, Montmorency cherries, grown on site at the family farm where they actually make this fantastic bourbon. The reason why Traverse City calls themselves the cherry capital of the world is because the five counties that surround Traverse City make up a region that produces 40% of the annual tart cherry crop for the entire United States. So they can, be, they can make that claim and back it up. One thing I found really interesting with this particular bourbon after, I, after tasting, as you can see here several times, is that with having, most of the time I'm not a big fan of infused flavors into whiskeys. This one, however, you would kind of think of maybe might, might be a little more on the sweeter side, but it ended up being a very, very nice, well-rounded bourbon, a little on the spicy side because it's corn, rye, and mulled barley as the mash. 35% uh, ABV or alcohol by volume or 70 proof. So it's not really a super heavy, strong bourbon as far as spice is concerned, which is also part of the reason why I thought it might become a little more on the sweeter side. But I was pleasantly surprised when it wasn't. So let's get right down to the brass tacks here. Color-wise, I think because of the cherry steeping, makes a little more of a reddish tint to it. Definitely a darker amber in color. Very pretty. On the nose, you definitely get some cherry. Lots of rye though. It's kind of the spicier as far as the nose is concerned. Very balanced. You can definitely smell the corn. Toffee. It's a very, very nice nose to it. Why a few windows begin to form pretty quickly, so that tells me this is going to be a little more on the drier side, so it's probably not going to coat the mouth near as much. Wasn't able to find out exactly how long this stuff sits inside the cask, but the triple X version sits in there for at least four years, so my guess is somewhere between three to four years for this. But let's take a taste. Again, with the cherry flavor, it's very mild in cherries. Not super sweet. Definitely a bourbon with a hint of cherry. Nice flavor. Something you could definitely put over top of the rocks, sit outside around a bonfire, sipping this all evening long, and have a great time with it. Again, Traverse City, Traverse City, Michigan. If you can find this stuff in your local dispensary, buy yourself a bottle and try it. It's, it's actually a pretty good product. On the end of the palate, Like I said, it doesn't hang around very long based on the windows that told me that was going to happen. Not a lot of burn as far as alcohol is concerned. But very, very smooth, very, very mellow. Nice little round of flavors. Definitely a, a nice sipping bourbon. If you're looking to get into bourbons for the first time, this might be one that actually kind of gets your palate a little bit wet into it because you get a little more of the sweeter notes to it. Nothing really super strong. But at the same time, you still get that bourbon flavor at the end of it. The cherries kind of hit you for, at first. Then you have your normal bourbon flavors toward the end, as far as apricots concerned, the vanilla, cinnamon. This is a very, very, but this is a very, very well nice rounded bourbon. How I recommend to try the Traverse City Cherry Infused Cherry Edition Bourbon. If you like what we do here at ENOE, please hit the like and subscribe button down at the bottom of the page. We'd love to hear from you, so please leave us a comment. And every Wednesday morning, I do post a picture of the bourbon or scotch or Canadian whiskey or Irish whiskey that we're tasting that week on Instagram every Wednesday morning. This week will be the Traverse City American Cherry Edition Bourbon. With that being said, the best bourbon scotch whiskey that's out there is one that you like to drink the way that you like to drink it. With that being said, cheers 
and have a great weekend.